Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Ken Domic food review just for you. I'm in the awesome town of Bradford, Ontario, Canada at a made in Mexico Mexican restaurant. It's mainly a sit-in and there's three locations, Newmarket, Bradford, and Barrie. Nice layout of the place. I love the atmosphere. I'd love to sit in there and eat. So uh, I ordered the spicy jalapeno chicken burrito and it comes with two sides and you don't want to put beans on uh, as a side you don't want to put uh what was the other thing or rice on the side so i went with uh the uh, tortilla soup and the house salad because the burrito already has all the rice and all the beans and all the things you want in it so this is gonna be spicy it already is hot in the car if the wind goes across this mic i apologize i have to keep these windows open because it is freaking hot in here now i'm gonna be eating a spicy burrito so it came to 1694 i'm not sure what it was before taxes after tax and everything 1694 so we got tortilla soup you have to put the tortillas in there and we'll do that first Maybe get that out of the way. I don't know, eat the salad first. And there's like a house guacamole kind of salad dressing, I believe she said. Oh yeah, so she gave me all the knives and forks, all the cutlery that I needed. Lots of napkins. Whoa! Okay, uh, not as big as I thought it was gonna be. Ooh, I thought nah. it was gonna be like fill this thing. You know how when you get some of those foods that we've been getting, it fills up the place. Wow. <laughs> Woo! Scratch that, sniff that. Holy guacamole, Batman. That looks like, oh my gosh, that's onions and uh, jalapeno crushed up and put all over the top. There's jalapeno juice, jalapeno juice in the bottom of that. I'm not sure if you guys can see that or not. Wow, wow. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna dump my salad in here make it look more presentable we'll put our salad dressing on oh there we go mm, kind of sweet tangy and if you've been to made in mexico if you work there leave a comment in the comment section below as to what maybe they they put in there we'll put our soup off to the side I've had tortilla soup a few times and it is quite good. It's almost like, like a tomato based soup. And then we got our tortilla chips. You sprinkle that in there, just like that. Cause you, you want them to be put in just before you eat it. So they stay with the crunch. You don't want your crunch to go. Ooh, scratch that, sniff that. The rest is mine. Not bad. It's almost like a minestrone type soup. I don't know what these things are. They're very soft. It's almost like a noodle. No, it's not noodle. Sour cream that's been, it was like in a squirt container and like that. It's just what I'm thinking. Again, I've had it before, but I can't remember. Mm. Again, hot soup on a hot day. When nobody's around, I drink it. It's just faster that way. So let's get this, uh, try this out. Salad. Again, there's they have a whole bunch of different sides, choices for you. I mean, if I asked for rice, chances are they would have put that in here with it. Not bad. The lettuce is a little brown. I don't know. I'm just telling it like I see it. I like the house dressing. It's nice. All right. Let's cut into this burrito. Wow. All right. So it's chicken, tortilla, and I'm pretty sure that's going to be all hot jalapenos on top. Tangy. 
Lots of lime, I guess. I didn't get any chicken in the first bite. We're gonna dig in deeper though. We're gonna keep digging. Oh yeah, that's all chicken right there. Hmm. She asked me if I wanted a jalapeno thing on the side. I said, it's probably gonna be hot enough, I'm imagining, but it really isn't. Oh. There's a nice bite to it. Sorry if the wind's going across the mic, guys. I apologize. Uh, there's the tangy, citrusy lime flavor. It's almost like that. What is that? The, the, I had like a lime, lime chicken burrito before, and it's very similar to that. Although I've never had onions uh, sprinkled all over the top with, uh, I guess, a drizzle of uh, sour cream and jalapeno sauce or a jalapeno bits oh boy there's another chunk of chicken the chicken tastes like it's seasoned nicely but mixed with this other stuff in here it is lovely mm. That is really nice. The chicken tastes fresh and not dry whatsoever. Nothing worse than dry chicken in your burrito. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we're getting to the, the thick of it. I, I this keeps keep this keeps moving. Now, the problem with the plastic, ah, see, the plastic utensils. I just found the beans in my burrito. It's nice, I thought it was gonna be way bigger and I was almost gonna get, I was almost gonna cut it in half. But I think I'll be able to eat this, no problem. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to give a one o'clock in the morning shout out bite to all you guys who've been leaving comments in a lot of videos about eating some more Mexican food. This is just for you. Are you ready? Oh, one o'clock in the morning shout out bite. Here we go. Three, two, one. Mmm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, as you know, I am always hungry. So I'm gonna pulse this off and I'll be right back. Hang on. for Ken. Nice. I'm pretty sure that's in. Ooh la la. All right, guys, on my rating scale, I'm going to have to give the spicy jalapeno burrito from Made in Mexico a would recommend. Uh, there's a couple things that I would have done to make it a go out and get it now. Uh, number one, uh, it tasted more like a lime chicken burrito than it did a jalapeno burrito just to give you guys a heads up so if you're looking for something really spicy ask for that extra sauce that they that she offered me again when i when you order a spicy jalapeno burrito you're going to think it's right off the top going to be spicy through and through they put spice through it whatever but it seemed just the uh, jalapeno crushed jalapeno on the top was the only spice in there excuse me guys i ate way too fast uh and just near the end there were like a couple spots on the soft tortilla shell that were stale. So uh, I can't give it a go out and get it now. Uh, it has to be a would recommend. The salad that they served me would have been indifferent because it was kind of like a brownish lettuce, not sure why. Maybe it was old lettuce, I don't know. Uh, and the tortilla soup is a would recommend as well. If you're, it's a good option to the side. Again, you don't want to have uh, beans and rice on top of your burrito. So having the soup is a nice change up for the rest of the meal. All right guys, if you enjoyed me eating some food from Mexico just for you hit that subscribe button it sits right around here click the notification bell but if you want to show your support for me eating this food and letting you know whether I like it or not hit it with a thumbs up ding 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 and we'll see you next time on another Ken Domic food review Ken Domic out Boop. oh this is thank you what is that? thank you thank you merci have a nice day 
Bon uh, something. Bon what? Welcome back to another Kendomic food review. Just, oh, we say food review. Uh, made for Mexico. Made in Mexico. Oh, they're gonna park right beside me, man. Why can't I get any peace around here? Some Mexican food. Mexican. Mexican. But if you want to show your support for me. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.